morning everybody it's Gina welcome back to the Firefly Studio 67 um, today I wanted to share with you guys uh, an entry I've made for Susanna who is a vintage blend studio here on YouTube I'll put her uh, link below uh, Susanna is also doing a friendship uh, journal challenge so I if you're interested in joining hers I can't recall the deadline uh, but you can check out her channel to find out the details on that. But I wanted to um, participate in her journal because I just think these are such a nice keepsake for everybody. And um, so here is my entry. Okay, this um, page here, I've got, you know, obviously the A4 that's been tea dyed. And then I came back with a book page pocket here, added some trim, so there's one pocket here, one behind here, and then this one, and then that, so it's four pockets on the front. And then I've just done some uh, handmade tags here with some stitching. I tried to, to do a lot of sewing on this because I do love to get the machine. <laughs> I like I like working on the machine. And then I just added various um, cards, you know, journal cards. I'm hoping that um, these will be something different that maybe she has not um, got in her own stash. Uh, you never know what, what people have. And then here I've just <clears throat> stitched the little dimensional butterfly and then I had to have a little B tag for her. And then this is I don't know if I can get it out. Um, just a tiny little envelope with a oh, I told you my fingers let me get my uh, my fingers I don't know it's so big now these tiny ones are difficult for me to get in and out but they're just that adorable so that's tucked in that little bitty pocket there on the front that's behind the butterfly and then stamped uh, V tag and like I said, just some collaging there with the um, the paper. And then in here, I wanted to c include something from me. I won't show that. Um, that's for Susanna to look at. Um, and then it, there is a pocket, obviously, she can fill with um, journal cards if, if she needs to. If, she's, <laughs> if her journal's like mine, I think she's going to find it really, really full. So... Um, here, um, this is a um, another pocket with some an old mother pearl button, lots of old vintage lace that I've got there, and that flips up. And then this has all been decoupaged, by the way. And I used the Tim Holtz um, collage medium that's in the vintage. I'll show you guys because some of you may be new. I've got a lot of new subscribers, and, and I've had correspondence from a lot of people who are new to this community. So this is what I'm talking about. When you use the one that's the vintage, it gives it a really nice, um, you can see, just a little bit of an aged versus the regular collage uh, medium, which is white. Let me see if I've got that. I think I may be out of that one, but it's white and will go on clear. So that's what I used on here because I, I wanted it to have a really uh, vintage look to it. And so here I've just um, taken more images and uh, layered those. And again, there's another big journal card. And then this was the rest of that napkin. I thought that was really <coughs> a pretty journal card. And I've stitched some fabric up there. So she's got... She's got plenty of writing space um, within, within this page. And then back here, I've got another journal card with a tag there, and I've stitched around that. So I hope Susanna will like this. Um, I've, <coughs> I've watched her for some time, so I think, I think that this is her style. She, and then I've got my stamp there. And then here, this is a uh, Tracy Fox. She has this, um, I can't recall the journal. Oh gosh, I'm so sorry guys. I can't recall which 
kit that came from, but I've cut it out so that this large journal card and, and then I backed all that, and that's all had the uh, collage medium on that. Um, and then I've made this big journal card, and I've done some light stamping and distressing, and then uh, fabric with more lace there. So yeah, as it started out, um, I wasn't sure how I was going to do this page, so that had been collaged. Um, I mean, sorry, I had added the collage medium back there, and then this fits in. It's snug, but it does fit in there. And I like that image showing through. So yeah, it's a vintage nature theme. And then on the back, this is another image from that, um, that kit. And then I've done a, just a little notebook here for her. And I've just added some more of the digitals in there and just some writing, extra writing paper for her. So there is my entry for Susanna. And I hope she will like this. I'm going to get this in the post to her straight away because it's going a very long way. <laughs> so I hope it gets to her pretty quick. Our, our post is pretty good. Um, if everything's working, it, it should be there right away. But I hope you guys have enjoyed that. If you got any questions, just leave them in the comments below, and um, I will be back very soon. I've got another one of these to share, so stay tuned.